Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Praxis and I'm back with another video, man. And this was a very requested fight about somebody. I can't think of who it was specifically, but they want Alexandre Pantoja. Here we go, man. He's going to, he's going to Luis Mocha. Very interesting pick, man. Shout out to Luis. He's uh he's on a lot of MMA Twitter. I know I see him a little bit. He took a loud. I believe he took a loss in his last fight, which is kind of unfortunate, but Actually, yeah, he did take a lot. I think he got finished. Pretty sure he got finished. Here we go. Unfortunately, we got to finish it twice. Okay. And I'm not going to lie. Some of these character models. Some of these character models need some legitimate love. Some of these guys' character models have been like the same since like the first UFC. Oh, uh-oh. Well, <laughs> GG's, man. GG's. For sure, GG's, man. Hey, ain't too much to say about that one, man. So I guess it's time to move on to the next fight. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, this is going to be a much tougher matchup, man. Much tougher with Brandon Moreno being... Hella tough, hella durable. Probably not gonna be able to get no finish in round one unless this guy really puts himself in a real dis like disadvantage. But here we go. All right, starts out. What we doing OG? He switches to orthodox. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh oh. Okay. He gotta be careful. I gotta be careful too. Cause a lot of times I be like, "Oh, come straight," but I got you. Got to realize you're fighting somebody that's a much better character. Whew. That man is aggressive. Aggressive. Oh no. Okay. So my man's here. I don't know what exactly he gonna throw. I just know he mad aggressive. Nice. Oh, that was nice. Catch the kick. Walk towards the cage. Spin an elbow. Land it clean. Low kick. No. There it goes. This man is aggressive, bro. Relax. You guys got to stop, like, you guys will be trading, right? You guys will lose a trade hard and just get rocked and come back and get the trade again. Bro, you're going to lose this trade. There you go. Pulls me down into the guard, but, man, you guys got to stop doing it, bro. Get back up to the feet. And, it, and it'd be like, he's going to throw a low kick. No. I didn't even know Brandon Moreno had a spinning hill. But, like, you guys got to stop uh, being so predictable and leaving yourself, giving, your, like, me so many opportunities to, to do so much damage. It's, like, crazy how you guys don't notice what I'm doing to you guys, like, consistently. Right? You'll make a mistake, and then you'll make the mistake again, and then you'll make the mistake again. Like, stop making that same mistake, bro. Are you not noticing that you're making a mistake? Oh, nice spin here. But it's like, come on, guys. Now, this guy has adjusted better with taking free damage. But at what cost, you know? Nice low kick. It's going to be an end of round one. around bro but man a lot of these guys just put themselves in a position to just to, to lose I mean ain't, ain't nothing else to say besides just to lose here we go round two 
I guess he was checking the stats. Bye bye. I wonder why he's sitting in Orthodox though. I mean Southpaw. He's trying to utilize his jab. So he's using his jab and then he's using a using a low kick as well. Three piece. And check that kick. My, my guy's just throwing a lot of jabs, double jabs, double jabs. Okay. So we have it, we've rocked his lead leg twice, right? So we can probably look to attack his leg also. You can see his jab is much better than mine. <laughs> his jab is much better than mine. So we're gonna attack his leg. And we just rock. Oh man. We gonna have to time his jab. We're gonna have to time his uh jab. Okay. And basically he's double jabbing us. Okay. Jab cross, jab, jab. Mm. The power of a good jab cross. The fight has completely changed just because of his jab cross. Thing is, I know they coming, and I've countered him a few times, like that right there. Let's see if he does the same thing. See what I mean? Too many times I've punished him for it. Problem is, not enough punishment for him just throwing jab crosses like that. Especially when I know they're coming. Okay. Wonder if he's gonna throw a spinning heel. I feel like I gotta watch out for him. There we go. To the body. Okay. Question is how many strikes he can throw that room? He threw 126, I mean, yeah, 126. I threw 107. So not too much of a difference, but you guys will notice how that one, two has completely changed the dynamic of this fight. I guess he's not, he's probably checking the stats. He's not skipping this. I believe he won a round. But I did get like, like a, one more rock to him or something. Here we go. So next time I rock this guy, he's moving his head a lot. I'm just going to go body, body, body. If I can get a rock. See what I mean? Jab, jab, cross. Then he throws the lead hooks. And this is real, real medish as far as uh, what he's throwing. A lot of times you try to mix him up. The one, two, into, or the lead hook mix up. Consistently lead hook, lead hook, lead hook, or the one, two. Real safe strikes. Real safe strikes. And I don't want to say real safe, but like much more safe than throwing anything else. You know what I mean? See so, what I mean? Let's go body, body, body. Okay. Woo. Okay. We keep on rocking his legs. We literally keep rocking his legs. That's what I mean.
This guy's literally one, two. One, two, or the lead hook. Like, he's exclusively made this fight like that with his offense. One, two, or lead hook. Probably lead hook right here. What is this, bro? I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, I guess we just move on to the next fight. That was kind of anticlimactic. Whatever. All right, here we go. Crazy Dragon. He got 2,100 rank points. Ah, <sighs> here we go. He's using John Dodson, which is uh, a pick you don't see often in flyway division. So respects to him for this pick, man. Here we go. Man, automatically starting off with jab pressure. Okay. Five round fight. Right. Okay. We're just gonna be patient. You guys gonna watch me play somebody aggressive and how I play them. You guys can see I'm consistently. He's aggressive, but his defense is lacking. His defense is lacking. Okay, he tries to counter me there. Three hooks to the body, he's landing clean. Just being, you guys will notice how I'm not giving him, a lot of guys, when you play uh, super aggressive guys, right? You play extra aggressive and you leave yourself extremely vulnerable. Well, what I'm doing is I'm throwing one or two strikes and not giving him many openings to land a counter or to trade too much because i know john dodson hits uh pretty hard so i just want to be careful right so with him already being extra aggressive we're just looking to attack his body a little bit more we will utilize our knees we can clinch him that way we put him on the cage and we have some space to back up from push him back push him back again we rock him here, go to the body, go to the body, back to the body. Nice. Okay, let's clinch him. I don't want to be right there. I'm just using this guy's aggression against him. Okay. And I guarantee his stamina isn't looking too good. Back up. There he goes, being aggressive. Cool, you're gonna be aggressive, I'm gonna clinch you. That way I can continue playing defensive. up this guy's uh just a whole bunch of aggression i don't know where he got to go today but uh he got somewhere to be Woo. this man has somewhere to go Check the strike count on this damn fight. 124. And I still outlanded him with more significant as well. I'll take it. Man, it's extra aggressive. Extra aggressive. Don't know how. Oh. He just tried to break my block. All right, so back to one strikes, two strikes, and just utilizing our feints as well. Pink, drop him down here. Just 
being being patient, man, because this guy's extremely aggressive. I feel like the uppercut is coming. You guys can notice how he's trying to throw three strikes, three strikes down the middle, right? And get me to commit to blocking all straight strikes with the animation. And then he'll go with a round strike. See, that goes two. Then that's the third. And then that's a round strike. You guys see what I'm talking about? There goes a three. There goes a round. And this is what most... This is what most ranked players do, honestly. Okay. Push him down. We're gonna throw two knees to his chin. We usually throw it to the head. I mean, we should throw it to the body. Okay. Look at our head health. Hit him with a three piece. He goes two down. You know what I don't get, guys? Um, I don't know if you guys notice when you do that animation where you stick your hand out. Right? Jab, jab. Spinning back fist. Yeah, he's literally just exclusively trying to break the block. Look at him, he's literally trying to. <laughs> oh man. And that's it. Oh man. Good fight, bro. Good fight. I probably should have been trying to slip more. But Jesus Christ. It's just a consistent block breaking. Just a consistent block breaking. But I'll take it. It is what it is, man. We got time for another one? Uh, we do. Hopefully we can get another match in. Don't want to go out like that. I lost all them damn points. What was that? I had 25-20. Now I got 24-67. You do the math. So go there. Yep, that's going to be the end of that fight, man. <laughs> Let's go ahead and move on to the next one, man. Okay, this is going to be, oh, this guy has 2,400 points. He's Ray Borg. Kind of interesting on how he's going to play exactly. Look at Ray Borg character model, man. EA got to do better. Some of these character models look like they just said, fuck it. <laughs> it really looks like they said, fuck it on some of these character models. Ray Boy's not really the striker. Well, not the best striker. I know he is very good in jujitsu. That's a nice fake. So I'm noticing that this guy has some real good fakes. Okay. It's probably think I'm about to go uppercut. I'm interested to see, wonder why he picked Ray Boy. Did he accidentally pick him or he ran out of time or something? That was a clean combo. Body. It's gonna be one of those clean fights. You check that kick. Oh, come on. I was gonna go body, body right after that. Oh. Mm. 
Mm. I'm kind of locked in on this fight. I ain't gonna lie. So my commentary isn't as crispy. Because I know this guy has a lot of points. And he's not bad at the game. He's actually very clean. Oh, he don't have a front kick to the face with the rear leg. Try to hit him with the counter. Ooh, ooh, okay, go crazy. Ah, oh, man, he gonna throw two knees. He didn't throw no knee. Ooh, that was nice. Mmm. This guy has some good defense, too. Nice. Good round, bro. Good damn round. Here we go, round two. I did not mean to throw that third round, that third uh, roundhouse to the body. Hey, this guy got some good feints too. Notice how he uses his feints to set up other strikes. Rayboy got the ugly kicks as well. Oh, the uppercut was timed well. Then a high kick. This guy's definitely clean. This guy's definitely clean. Oh, no, oh my. That, replay that sequence. Replay that sequence and watch how I just set him up with everything. Replay that damn sequence and watch how I set him up with going, changing levels with my strikes consistently in that whole sequence. Thing with that. Thing of beauty. Ooh. That movement. Uh oh. Caught him with that counter. Caught the kick. Throw a high kick. Oh, come here, body, body. Man, block my body shots. What a smart man. And honestly, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. That rock shouldn't happen. I'll be completely honest. I just slipped a front kick and was able to knock him down. Or rock him, not knock him down. Oh, he almost hit me with the same counter I hit him with. Body, body. Throwing these little simple crosses to the body. Okay. Faint. Bye. Bye. All right, good round. I use a lot of stamina in that round, though. Go. I think we won the last two rounds. I go rock. Then he blocks that one. So this guy has some good defense, man. 
This guy has some real good defense. Ooh. I wonder who this is. I, I, the name just doesn't look familiar. TGE Will Twitch TV. Like I've been on. Uh-uh. Body, body time. Uh-oh. Ooh. Oh, nice. Ooh. Let's see if we can get up. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna jab cross high kick you. That's bum activity. I ain't gonna jab cross high kick you. There's no need to to duck. So next time I rock y'all, be sure to go jab cross uppercut. I ain't gonna lie, my stamina ain't looking hot. My stamina is not looking hot at all. I don't know what his looking like, but your boy ain't looking too hot over here. Not going. He ain't playing with blocking the head. All right, we can. I guess we settle off into the next round. If that landed. That would have been sleepy time. That would have definitely been sleepy time if that landed. Check the stats. So round one, me. Round two, me. Round three, me. What is this, round four now? Here we go. I'm wondering what his damn stamina looks like. Because I believe I got some body rocks on this guy as well, though. Some nice body roundhouse. Uh oh. This guy's real tricky with his high kicks too. He's real tricky with him. There we go. Body, body. Even when he's blocked, man, his dude defense is clean. Okay. Ooh. Uh oh. Okay. Hey, 100%. By the way, 100% respects for this Ray Borg pick. You don't. You're not gonna see Ray Borg in ranked, especially when someone with this many rank points. You're not gonna see Ray Borg much at all. Here we go. We get the rock. I know we caught him with that with that uppercut counter before. I wonder if we can catch him again. Nope. 
Man is ready for it. Nice uppercut. Oh no. I'm gassed. I'm gassed. Oh. I think we did enough though. I ain't gonna lie. I think we did enough. Got a rock. I feel like we've done enough in this fight. To get the round. Is he gas too? He is. This close. This close to losing that fight. It's a war right here. I ain't gonna hold you. This is a damn war. Let's get it. Oh, it's still showing I'm gas. I'm not even gas. I'm good. Looking like Brian Ortega. That uh, that round versus Volk. This is your defense, man. Maybe it's just my offense. There we go with a knockdown. Another knockdown. Oh. Don't try to block break me, man. Don't do me like that, OG. You know I wasn't going for that one. Not that head kick. <laughs> Not that head kick. Oh! I knocked him down. He rocked me. <laughs> Cross stung him. I feel like that should have been a fight. We is over here gas. We is over here gas. I don't even want to throw no no uppercut. I mean no lead hook to his body because because I just know. I just know. Never mind. That's it. That's it. The cross put on the bed. That was a good fight, though, bro. That was a damn good fight. A real good fight, man. GG is giving his respects. Oh, man. And again, like I said, man, he went Ray Borg. He could have made this fight 10 times, you know, 10 times harder if he would have went, you know, someone like uh, Brian Moreno, Figueredo, you know, TJ Dillashaw. But he went Ray Borg, so 110% respect on my end to him. And with that being said, guys, that's the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe up, and don't forget to turn on those post notifications, man, so you don't miss any streams or any uploads, okay? If you guys do me one favor, stay up, stay up, let's keep moving forward. Love you guys, man. See ya!